where would you put logistics performance in terms of your mm -hmm. priorities, given you're, you're looking across a global organization mm -hmm. and supply chain? Our issue is really unfinished vehicles, 100%, um, and, I, and I know we're not alone with that. Um, so spending a lot of energy, and I would say, um, if you ask me my top five issues, it's in the top five, and if you ask my CEO, her top five, it's in her top five, is um, you know, the need to be able to, to move um, the vehicles that we build. And um, I think there's a number of reasons which um, you know, we're working directly with our partners on to, to help, but I think probably some underinvestment, if we're honest, over the last couple of years and some critical assets and capacity. And I think uh, labor struggles uh, that exist everywhere, um, this is also an industry that, um, that's impacted by that as well. In the meantime, what we're really looking for is as much self-help as, as the network can give to um, help us move vehicles. Because you know, we're, we're at a point where customer demand is still very strong, inventory at dealers is still very low, and we've got vehicles that are basically built and ready to ship that we can't move. And um, we have got to collectively make the investments and be strategic. And I think, you know, if I look at everything else that we're doing um, in, in my space, we can absolutely be longer term, more strategic in almost every aspect of, of, of our supply chain setup. So if we need to do things from a haulaway standpoint, from a rail car standpoint, even from an ocean vessel standpoint that, that secures a more, a longer horizon and a more stable partnership and, and um, flow, these are things we're absolutely prepared to do, but we've, we've got to, we've got to get over the hump here so, um, so we can move the vehicles that we build. We're going to go into more detail on that with, with some of your team mm -hmm. um, uh, at our conference. Mm -hmm. uh, if I, I'll just plug it, actually, September 26th, 28th uh, in Dearborn. Don't miss it. Um, thanks again for your support on, on that.